This is the guitar lesson for Jethro Tull's Locomotive Breath, the easy way and the correct way. All right, starting off, guitar in the standard E tuning. Okay, and the chords you gotta know, you gotta know your E minor. You gotta know your G. You gotta know your D. And you gotta know your B. And last but not least, you gotta know your A. Okay, those are the basic chords right there, okay? This song is played on electric guitar, but for the sake of how cool it sounds around a campfire, I'm going to show you on my acoustic, okay? Everybody knows the main, um, I guess the signature uh, sound of the song, right? The... All right, and that's the intro, and the intro is actually on piano, and then it goes into that part of the song, okay, which is E minor. G, D, back to E minor. All right, so what I'm doing for the intro and the verse, the E minor, G, D, E minor part, the All right, is I'm doing E minor. I strum it down twice, and then I strum the strings open, okay? So I'm not strumming completely through the strings, okay? I'm only kind of emphasizing the first four or five strings. I'm not... I'm kind of going, I want that thick feel, so I'm plucking really hard the first four or five strings, okay? So, down, down, off, G, strum all the way through them, D, strum all the way through D, and then back to E. Okay, so on E, I'm actually muting all the strings. I have my fingers on the strings so they don't, they don't ring, okay? and it gives me that cool. All right, try messing around with it. Put your fingers on the strings. Don't push super hard. You can push um, a little bit hard if you want to, but all you gotta do is just make them so they don't ring, okay? You don't want any of the strings to ring when you do this. Uh, it's kind of like chucking the strings, okay? Chuck, 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 chuck. All right, so once again. G, E, E minor. And on that last E minor, I'm actually strumming really hard through all the strings, so. And now this is the one change up in the song, okay? This is where it goes, uh, you could almost say it's the pre-chorus, okay? So it goes... Let me see here. To B instead of back to E minor. And that sets me up perfect because I can just take my fingers off the strings and I'm muting... I'm just basically taking the tension off the B and I'm muting all the strings still. And then I go to... I'll show you that B part one more time, okay? So instead of it's this B B B B B D, then back to E minor. And then it goes into this part, which is the chorus, I guess you could say. Then G. Old Charlie uh, stole the handle, okay, so. Handle is A, so G, A. And then train, B. And the train, it won't stop going. Uh, no, way, no, no way to slow down, okay, so B. Then B, 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 B. Back to the E minor, the intro riff. I'll show you that last part again. Now really slow, all right.
E minor. All right, and that's the whole song. So I hope that was easy for you, to, for you to see. If you have any questions, please let me know. Please subscribe to my channel and please like and comment on all my videos you can, okay? Um, also, if you'd like me to teach you how to play guitar, every single thing I know, uh, please check out my course, teachmeguitar.guitarmadeeasy.com. And I will see you guys on the next guitar lesson. Thanks.